Oh yes, and I think we are live. Hello everybody. Welcome to an early lobby of the week races. Oh, get the stream up on my phone. Oh yes. Hello everyone. And we decided to open the early lobby, so I thought I would stream to ease on his internet a little bit. On my internet. It's not the issue. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think it could help. But yeah. You've already got somebody in with her. Random, an Italian. And the big boy Beamer. Actually, in the same corner. Yeah. <coughs> everybody is welcome. It's an open lobby. Just have to search a track in the group of car, and you should find the. Change the title of the room to on YouTube and uh, uh -huh. live live on YouTube in the title of the lobby. <laughs> It'll attract people. <laughs> oh. Five to six. Hopefully. People are just finishing their tea and so oh, fancy a bit of racing on Grand Trisman. Speak, Mr. Shepard. Racer, get your ass in here. <laughs> First question: Can you hear Enra, Racer? And welcome. Because <laughs> I don't think he's got his voice shared. I, I do. You do? Oh, excellent. Well, then he heard so. you. He heard you clear as day. Hopefully. Yeah, your voice is like, oh, that's enough. Uh. That's what I'm like. Oh, yeah. Five viewers, come on. Come on in, people. Got some early hour fun on soft tyres. Group three, no tyre wear. No nothing. Just. Fun. Shallow bars. Four or five lap races. Just two, uh, well, two GRT, and then there's just a random Enjo. We don't know, because the room is open. Yeah, everyone, great racer. Yo, Jason, welcome, welcome. 
You can jump in if you've got some spare time. Just you're not going to be on too long. Probably about an hour, hour and a bit. The room, it is an open lobby. So, if we get a few people in, we may get some we may get some rotten apples, you never know. They're everywhere on Grand Trismal. Oh, oh, streaming, doing jazz. Well, forget a copyright strike on the stream because there's music playing in the background. <laughs> I change your face. Yo, Jason. Has his way. <laughs> mm. yeah, just. If Enra wants to be you, he goes group two Bathurst. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just got a just got a Thor gear shifter for the T three hundred this weekend. Who? Nice. You can't really use it on this game. No, there's, no, there's not many times to use it. Doesn't have an advantage anymore. It used to, but they, they, they just took the took the use of it out of the game. So yeah. <laughs> yeah, I noticed that you can only use it when you're doing arcade and shit. Yeah. Oh, you're working, racer. Oh. We'll kind of th three more hours. Oh my god! Oof. Although sometimes I can get it to work in people's lobbies, it's just that the clutch doesn't work. Ah, uh, so you just shift and it changes gear. Yeah, I can't. Yeah, I can't get the clutch override to work. So. Yeah. All right. Let's see if the room will pop up for me. Should is uh, public. <coughs> Should yeah, there we just yeah. take friends. Nice. Good in the nations yesterday. I qualified seventh and got uh, got second. Oh, nice. That's good. Did the uh, did the Australian ones yesterday morning? It was, uh, it was fun. <laughs> A couple of times I looked back and just seen carnage. Yeah, yesterday friggin' there was a lot of friggin' accidents. Yeah. I managed to avoid most of them, but... <laughs> Just hope Moses is on your side that day.
so weird. I've gone through more controllers playing Grand Tourism than I've done playing Battlefield. <laughs> Just because that sensitivity field with the steering and stuff. Yeah. The controllers are fully functional, but I don't feel like you respond good enough for racing. No, we don't know. It starts to get loose. I don't want to start a racist few people. Or you can just go racing for fun. Racing for fun. Another track might lure people in. Yeah, yeah it is a bit of a pain I mean, in the ass track. This doesn't seem to favor I mean, if I see Majori on a lobby list, I'm like, ooh! <laughs> I like this track both ways. It doesn't matter to me. Like, I, can, I think I'm better the other way than this way. Than, like, the original. Yeah, I like it the other way. It's that last corner. Just, I hear coming down here on that last corner. <laughs> yeah, I prefer T4 on this track. Yeah. What you think it's good for? A road goes, fun in road goes. a casual eight hours ahead. <laughs> oh, yeah. Are you in uh, Switzerland or something? Uh, Norway. Norway, okay. But it's on the same like types of Yeah, I have a buddy who lives in Switzerland, he's eight hours ahead. Oh, the races at work. Yeah. He's watching the stream at work. Yeah. Not the task it. I'll be right back. No problem, man.
teasing code out of a cookie gifts. It's just evil racing. Good fun at the same time. Yo. Spark shop. Yeah. Grocery store. Uh, about 10k away from me, but it with me going. Because that's where that's the only place close by that so sells the bread. Just space fresh for longer. Yeah. And they have this fresh. Uh, sometimes it's just a whole chicken. Sometimes it's Chicken wings, sometimes it's uh, chicken legs, like thighs and stuff. Yeah. Oh, Spring rolls filled with baguettes. Oh. Go ahead, man. you when you did that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I started racing this, put that in the controller, just, oh shit, yeah, pr probably should turn. <laughs> nah. It lacks of the cookie. the cookie gift. Shit, sorry. It's all good, man. I use uh, I use bumper cam, so I've got a I've got a mirror. <laughs> it's uh, one of the main reasons I like using it. I'm 
is in boot camp and I'm solely relying on seeing the dives on the radar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't want to be in that late before I see dive bombs. Speaking of dive bombs, he's a legend. Yeah. The TV to it, he stayed up so late. I know. Right. We're in the party with him. Just when we're in Lagos, he's like, do you want us to slow down a bit? Just push up against him. He's like, no, let's go. Because we, <laughs> we all got clumped together. Fighting and stuff and dive bombs just like clear air, so he could just go. Think, nope, just go, just just smash it. <laughs> Are they good in that area? Oh, yeah. That one stop tactic we had paid off. Eventually. Yeah. Well, against everybody but uh, the dude in the bloody beamer. He had some amazing tired He did, yeah. Yeah, if he's on probably wouldn't be, but if he was on the pad, my god. But it's fuel him as well, it was Yeah, it was really good. You know, I thought I thought I was fuel saving good and I went in I had was it five, six percent of fuel? And then he done an extra lap or two, come in, you have 11% of fuel. Jesus! <laughs> exactly. This is crazy. I would have probably had an empty tank and he's still got 11 laps, 11% uh, of fuel. Just chuck that three Yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't feeling it. I did testing and I was just... I had such a bad feeling. So I dropped out. I just I seen your message. When you say it's like I'm officially dropped now. And then I was like, I'm gonna have to go have a look at the track list and see the tracks. I was like, ooh. <laughs> in Lagos, ooh. Make a bit in Lagos. Not, not a massive fan of Catalina, buddy. Like it. Good at everything, it's just good at everything. <laughs> yeah, just keeping up with the GTR in straight lines now. I know. The GTR used to like say, Thank you, come again, bye bye. <laughs> everything. I get that penalty then. <laughs> yeah, I lifted it. I lifted it. Where did that come from? Put the stream back and have a look. You're watching your car in front of me. Cut the corner. Oh, missed. Oh, 
on the podium. <laughs> Yo, Rob. Rob's in the chat. Oh, White Hood makes it tricky. Oh, yeah, well, that's uh, to see the gears. <laughs> Get in here, Rob. I've seen you try to... You, sh you changed from the TT to the Pug just to beat my time because I beat you to Pug. <laughs> <laughs> I was just, yes, I beat Rob. He was in the TT. And, yeah. uh, I think it was uh, race A. Yeah, yeah the Monza. Monza. <laughs> and I went, fuck, I can't get him in the TT. I'll better try the LP car, the Pug. I'll be back in a sec. No problem, Jason. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, you probably <laughs> couldn't beat your time. Beat his time. Changed no, to the pug, and then yeah, beat at the your time. Today it is harsh. Yeah. <laughs> Jumped on early this morning. Yep, yeah, the TT Rob. is slow yeah, at Monza. Yeah, he says the he TT is slow. He doesn't get up to speed in uh, after a first chicane properly. No, they kill the, the top end. The second chicane, if you cut it perfectly, it doesn't lose too much. But yeah, and the pug turns a little bit better, it doesn't pull out as much as the TT. Yeah. So yeah. But the, be the funnest parts were when uh, I was beating uh, Mr. Pug's times. <laughs> or a good old Mr. Heppo. <laughs> yeah. Who I wish all the best. Yeah. Yes. Some trouble to see him again minute. soon on mm -hmm. the track. Let's go. <coughs> yeah. That one that keeps you in order. <laughs> Racer needs to drop off half a second in a race. That's hard, man. Even a tenth of a second's hard when yeah. you're pushing at your limit. Sure. I, I did the. Um, Race C, the group 2 one, yeah. at the Tokyo track. Yeah. And I was just, how the hell are people going this fast? I was just, I was so far off. Yeah. You just point, know they're sitting just, for like an hour okay. doing laps. <laughs> going to the top 10 times, looked at the top guy in the Lexus time at yeah. that point, and I shade one and a half second instantly. Oof. Like, dino. Great. But that chicane. Nope. Oops. The last chicane there. <laughs> you can cut the first curve a little bit, but if you go on the second curve, on the left, yeah. oh, that that sends you airborne. Yeah. You know, Rob says the pug feels like it has decent traction. The TT was just wheel spinning. Yeah, well, when you were turning yeah. and stuff, I was finding that. I'd go with the TT. And Reyes is asking what be what brake balance. He says he's three to f three to four to the rear. On what car race here? On the race, if it's race A, I'm neutral on brake balance. I'm at zero. Probably be better if I change it, but can't be bothered. You can't be bothered. <laughs> nah, because I don't like I uh, don't like to experiment so that I should yeah. do. Don't just like yeah, messing about. We just jump in. And I just put it at zero. And work. If I'm in a front engine rear wheel car, yeah, in a tire wear race, I just put it towards the back <laughs> <laughs> to save the fronts. Three to the rear, huh? Yep, race here, three to the rear, says Rob. It will help the fronts turn, putting the brake balance to the rear. <coughs> what track should you put on to bring people in? Um, track to people like. Track to people like. Um, I can't even think. The Dragon Trail or or somewhere 
Fuji, people like Fuji, don't they? Oh, into Lagos. <coughs> um, Let's do into Lagos. Oh. Oh. Four laps, yeah. Uh, yeah, four laps, two rooms, then. Oh, just remember. Got a nuke ball. I'll be back in a second. Reverse grid based on previous race. Oh. Uh, racers, I'm at uh, zero. Just because I haven't changed and tested different brake balances out. Important. Uh, she's at work right now asking me where the other quarries are. I see a lot of the group likes playing Siege, huh? Yeah. They do. I I I bought it yeah. when it first came out, but yeah, yeah, I, yeah I, I have it too. I just I'm not really into it. No. Yeah, same. Honestly, but if I was gonna if I'm gonna play a first person shooter, I'd rather play fucking America's Army. Give me Battlefield and I'm happy. It's fun getting on with Gemini uh, give me battlefield and guard and, and stuff. And a but... mate that logs shit on that <laughs> you have a great night. Which Battlefield? Four. Four. Yeah, I play four as well. Oh yeah. I'm a, I'm a chopper guru. Oh yeah. That's all I do in the game is fly the choppers. <laughs> yeah, you hate those people. But it's fun though to shoot the people. <laughs> <laughs> <Most> people. <laughs> yeah. There's many times uh, me and Ran, the missus, have stood there with smalls and RPGs shooting at choppers. <laughs> but, uh, yes. But right, I play, um, I play a lot of DayZ. Oh, DayZ. I haven't played, uh, I don't think, no, I haven't played DayZ. Actually, that's funny. That's what I was just playing before I came and joined you guys. Mm -hmm. I left the uh, I left the wife in one of the big towns on the coast and friggin' had to uh, do a run to all the military bases to go get her some gear and stuff. So <laughs> go get her some stuff before you left. Yeah, and then I had to run my ass all the way back to her, and now I gotta wait for her to get home so I can give her all her stuff. <laughs> Oh wow, it's been a while since I've been on this track in a G3. Oh yes, the bad boy. I like that livery. Go on in, just slide it in there. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, that's light it out here. <laughs> ah, Chevy. <coughs> oh, 
Hello Paul, Mr. Bliss, welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Just having a little Doing a little lobby. Oh, he's joining the room as well. For an hour and a bit. Won't be going too long. So I've got to, got to have some tea and stuff. And Gard will be doing his lobby. So in a couple of hours. I've been playing a lot of Warzone as well. Really like it. I tried to get into that when it first came out. I think I spent about a week on it. Yeah. It's it's gonna be really hard if you like for you coming from DZ and then jumping on COD. It's like what's this shit? <laughs> well, so, again, I play a lot of America's Army as well, and that's and a that, first-person shooter. Yeah. It's kind of like old school SOCOM, but in first person. Yeah. Oh yeah, I remember them games, man. Oh, what awesome. And it's uh, it's also free if you have a North American account. <laughs> oh, how many people get on a uh, Hippie America? I'm gonna join Bliss. No problem. The more the merrier. Once we get about five, six people in the lobby, it'll look more attractive to people. was a COD fan in the Modern Warfare days and then COD started to go a bit downhill but while I was playing COD I was playing like Battlefield well I played a bit, bit, bit of Battlefield 3 but I started playing more with Battlefield oh, 4 the good old Battlefield 3 days oh I know man oh I'd love absolutely love to have it on this console I would be on it all the time but, uh, yeah. and then I brought out uh, Hardline, it was like, eh. And then they brought out one, it was like, oh, this is good. And, and then they brought out five. And it was like, well, even watching the trailer, it was just like, what is this? It's just, it's just, no. <laughs> I had no England whatsoever of pre ordering it or nothing. Just didn't look yeah, interesting. I played a beta for Battlefield 1 and I just. Nope. I played a beta for Battlefield 5 and I was the same. I played a I beta like... for that and I was just. Mm, feels better and I bought it and I regretted it. Yeah. I'd never been into Kado. A mate of mine lured me into getting. Can't remember which one it was. And after a few rounds. I was just not. No Twilight wonder the uh, screamy kids think you're very good when you see the kill cam <laughs> and the hit markers are like three feet behind you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, it was bad back then. That's why I like playing Warzone rather than the team deathmatch. Hell. I remember a lot of playing Rush on Battlefield 3. Yeah, oh, Rush was. Battlefield 3 was made for Rush. And that was a problem with 4. 4 was made for Conquest. And then I tried yep. to put Rush maps on it and it just didn't work. It just didn't work. Ooh. Ooh. <coughs> yo, Mikey! Yo, yo, yo! Welcome in, welcome in. Are you jumping in? Hey Happy. Mikey. Mikey! We won't be going forever. Just gonna do like an hour and a bit stream. Just to do a little bit of racing. Whoa! So, <laughs> I'm gonna be uh, doing other things tonight, so I think this is gonna be my only chance to race. <laughs> Time 
playing with the missus on the pewter. ISRL tomorrow night as well. I'm looking forward to that. See you in a bit, Ria Saman. Thank you for dropping in, buddy. Take care, sir. Guess his lunch break's over? It must be, yeah. <laughs> Poor Ria, sir. Jag just killed Paul. Safety car, safety car. <laughs> I think no playing with that Jag anymore. Romancing, of course. Gotta have the playtime with the missus. Gotta equal out. Nick racing with gaming with misses. Do some like, war zone or some Elder Scrolls. Cause I was really silly the other day and was sort of in a rush. And I bought um, the PlayStation Now subscription for a month instead of PlayStation Plus. <laughs> so, at least I got a free month of, well, not a free, uh, free month, like a uh, month of. PlayStation now to play about. I think I might make it a regular thing though. So start well if we had things start playing Elder Scrolls this morning with uh Geordie Lass and we played for like two hours and I made my little character and then I went back to the main menu and I, oh, I quit the game for a bit and I turned the game back on and it was like I just started the game. It just went to character creation screen. I was like eh so it was like I hadn't even played it, which was really weird. So I don't get that. So, no problem, Paul. We'll uh, speak to you in a minute. Yeah, man, there's some cool stuff on that PlayStation now. I downloaded uh, Mudrunner the other day, Mikey. Have you got? Have you downloaded Mudrunner? Jump on some mud run away. I jumped on it the other day for a couple of hours. God, it was fun. Just, just enjoying trudging around in the mud. It was great fun. And uh, what else did I download? A set of Corsa. I downloaded a set of Corsa. What else was it? Mrs. downloaded that observation. That was mad. It's a it's a game you you play AI on board a, sp a space station, and you've got to advise the human on what's going on. It's, it's pretty mad. Yeah, I've seen loads of loads of games. It was just like ooh ooh Metal Gear collection as well. I added that to my list. Well, I'll be playing. Uh, I want to be playing some Metal Gear. I love the old Metal Gears. I think the only one it hasn't got is one. Because it's got two. It's got Snake Eater, and then Peace Walker. And then it's got the one we're riding, Resurrection or something it's called. And they've got Sons of uh, Guns of the Patriots and Sons of Liberty. It's, it's all good. I love Metal Gear Solid. Wants to <laughs> Paul wants to beat your team. Yeah, <laughs> I just seen that myself. He's going to get. He's got some. He's got some like, like sugar water. He's jigging himself up. So come on, smash him. He's in the jig. I like that Aston Livery. Have I already picked up? Uh, we may go there.
on Saturday I'm probably gonna spend two and a half, three hours cleaning my car. <sighs> yeah, I've been there uh, putting down new tarmac on the yeah. road. I'm uh, driving on to work. Yeah. And they're uh, putting down three layers uh, to like get it properly and get all like a proper layer to wear down. Yeah, like a nice thick layer of tarmac. And the two first layers are like super sticky and rough. Yeah, and it just knocks up loads of sticky the little bits. <laughs> yeah, oh. I see it on the rims too, that is a lot of black spots. Oh. That's funny, that's what I do for work. <laughs> oh, can you, asphalt, can you drop asphalt. by to Norway? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I do asphalt and interlock. Uh, oh, interesting. Yeah, I build houses, or anyway. Mm. Oh man, you should see his house, Jason. Oh. I want to just pay in right just to come, to stay for a week, just like, about, like I'm on holiday. <laughs> Jesus, you should see his man cave. Oof. Beautiful. Was it like a 70 degree angle or something, everything's at? Something like that. Got the table specially made to fit the same angle as oh, the room and, uh, and everything. Outdoor area. Dirty posh, dirty posh bastard. <laughs> <laughs> it looks posh bastards. It looks absolutely amazing. I didn't I seen it. it was just like man cave. Ma so you can picture man cave. It's this, it's this dingy little room in the back of the house with some strip lights in <laughs> to help illuminate it a little bit. And I was like, oh, here's my man cave. And everybody's like, oh my god, it looks like a spa room. Just needs a massage table <laughs> in the middle of it. I, I need to go out and, uh, one day at night and take, put on the lights and the fire to take a proper picture of how it looks at night. Oh, man, I'll be I'll be swimming over. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, the seas are calm. Let's go. Mhm. Mm exactly. Yeah, it's not winter yet. <laughs> It's not winter yet. If you hit the curd, probably you might drift up here. Uh, I probably <laughs> Pick will. Up in I probably will. <laughs> Just catch a ride with the Gulf Stream. Yeah. I'll just jump on one of the banana boats that everybody's coming in on. Do they still have that ferry or uh, from Newcastle? Yeah, still there's the P&O ferries here, yeah, still come from Newcastle. It goes to Stavanger, isn't it? Mm-hmm, so. yeah, yeah. I remember Top did that. <laughs> no, he was... Clarkson did the uh, SLR. Yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, oh, it's a beast, that thing. They <laughs> the two fuckers broke two boats. No way. No way. <laughs> but he was, mm. it just says the ferries yeah, still go to Newcastle, and it's like, yeah. He's asking if the ferry still goes to Newcastle. So go, oh yeah. It's a massive port. It's, it's crazy. I'm just walking to the shop because it's like a... Well obviously it's like a valley because it goes to a river but it's <laughs> it's like a... It's not a small like incline. It's like quite... gets to the river and it goes steep. So it just looked like there's a... There's like a hole. You know as you say it's like the top of a ship going past. <laughs> it just looks, it looks just across the top of the houses. It looks absolutely mad. Just a big ferry, P and O, just drifting past. Ah. Like, oh. I'll wait for you, boys. That is not when you're back. It's just us four anyway, so... Yeah. I think with kids going back to school and people going back to work... Yeah, my kid goes back on Monday. Yeah, my kids went back like this Monday. And there was kids went back it's, last uh, week. So. It's funny because uh, the French part of Canada, uh, they sent their kids back to school last week. And now, apparently, eight out of, I don't know how many schools, um, have had COVID in the schools now. Yeah. 
so I'm kind of iffy if I actually want to send my kid back to school or if, uh, or if uh, I'm going to have them home school. Yeah, we were as well, but I just... Norway had a good almost COVID this summer, then they opened up and some cases popped up and then the student started and they had these, uh, it's like a gathering week when they, there's people that has been to, at the school for a year or two before they get uh, selected groups and they join up, party, come up with like stuff to do together. Yeah. And the COVID cases has exploded. What they did? Because they didn't take, they didn't take the proper precautions just... and stuff. Yeah. And as soon as they opened the borders to Sweden this summer, like people like put man over heels and holes in everything. Was, oh, we have to go. We have to go. Oh, Pips, we need to ride Pips man. I mean, we usually, we are like three, four mates, we usually go one, two, three times over to Sweden, one yeah. just before Easter and one and before summer and one before Christmas, so you just stock up once and get cheaper. And I didn't miss it, like... <laughs> I don't care, like, okay, we can go there, we could go there if we wanted to, but I don't want to take the risk. It's not a necessity. Take the, I kind of got sick of some of these. I'd take the quarantine lift and people are like, right, everything's back to normal. It's like, no. It's yeah. <laughs> we're allowed, like, out to go do necessary things, like work, you know. Oh well, yeah, when June hit, we had a whole bunch of uh, people in different cities uh, start going out to like the beaches and the parks and shit like that, and then all of a sudden they got rampant again, and then they shut everything down, and then, I don't know, I think it was two months ago, they freaking reopened everything up again, and... But I guess uh, most people learned the first time, so everybody started either staying home or, or actually, you know, properly uh, wearing masks. Using hand, hand cream and sanitizer, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I didn't even leave my house for freaking a, a couple of months. Like, except for like to go out to work and shit like that. We were doing a lot of uh, online ordering and stuff like that. Yeah. I think a lot of people were, we were. People getting that shopping online, you know, just to. Uh, regular grocery shopping, yeah. if they could. I was mid knee surgery rehab, when that uh, hit shit had to pan first yeah. time. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Putting pictures up of your knee all bandaged up and shit. Uh, I mean, I was lucky though, to, that I had my surgery when I had it. Yeah. Because yeah, uh, uh, one of my neighbors, an elderly guy, he was he was laying on the operation operating table, ready to have his back surgery, and the surgeon came in and said, uh, "Bad news, uh, we kind of need rooms for other stuff, so we can't just do the operation." He was on the table. Oh, Jesus, that's yeah. I've been waiting since November to get. Uh specialist to look at my back. I have a uh, compression fracture in my T12 and then I have some kind of a growth growing on my C3, 4 and 5. Oh. Uh, yeah, they've been putting me off for a year and I haven't even gotten a call from the specialist yet. Luckily at my job I do most of the, uh, of the equipment operating so yeah, don't have to do much lifting. No, we got yeah, we got the young kids to do all the back breaking shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, classic. <laughs> uh, you're yeah. young and fit, you do this. Mm. Mm. Do you get to do the young the sport? Hey sport, can you go grab that over there? <laughs> With the young little legs and back. Go on, go go pick it up now. 
I need it. I'll be back one second. No problem, dude. That's it. Uh... Yeah, I struggled a lot with my back in my uh, late teens and early twenties. Yeah. Went to a lot of specialists. Like physiotherapy, osteopaths, all that. And I don't remember who came up with the solution or the diagnosis, but I think it was the osteopath. And she said, like, well, she asked me, have you, like, hurt your tailbone anytime? And, and I was like, well, when I was younger, there's two times I've they hit my table, so I didn't want to sit for a week afterwards because it was so painful. And she was like, "Yep, that's hurting your table." Huh? And she thought it was uh, due to those two times that I had a uh, compression in my lower back, on my spine, because yeah. I had, I don't have any movement in my lower back. Right. So all, when I bend over and do some heavy lifting, it like centers higher up in the back. Oh right, yeah. And therefore, it got a lot more pain. But I started. We had some courses to how to lift properly and stuff. Would oh, work I had. Oh, okay. I can cope with it now, and I know it's what to avoid. But that uh, knee surgery and COVID shit, when it all, every like health thing locked down, that was not good for my back. No. Sitting or laying there. Yeah, it was just doing exactly the same thing, man. So just say, I'll change car. I'll pick something. I need, I need a piss too. Quick, right quick right. run. <laughs> Watch your race. Watch your race. Oh, what's your leg? Did you hear about the millionaire who had the big huge house party? No. Yeah, so the millionaire is having a big huge house party and uh, he's got two pools in the backyard. One is for all the guests to lounge and party in and the other one's got man-eating sharks in it. Uh. So, about two or three hours into the party, you know, he gets up on his little stage there where the music's playing off of and everything and uh, stops the music and gets everybody's attention. He says to everybody, he says, look it, I'm really, really bored. So here's what we're going to do. I am going to write a $1 million check and I will give the keys to my Maserati and my Ferrari and to anybody who can swim from one end of the pool to the other with the man-eating sharks in it and you can have your choice of whatever cunt in the party that you want. 
<laughs> so it's a real hush hush for about a minute and all of a sudden you hear a splash and everybody looks towards the pool and there's this guy swimming for dear life <laughs> starting at one end of the pool and he's just giving her and giving her and then you see the start shark starts circling him because they got his scent he gets to the other end of the pool, and he starts climbing down, two guys rush over and pull him out of the pool, and the millionaire runs over and he was like, yeah, that's the greatest thing I've seen in a while. Here's your million dollar check, here's the keys to the car, and now tell me, which cunt in this party would you like? The guy looks up to the millionaire and he says, I want the fucking cunt that pushed me in. <laughs> 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 that was good. That was good. <coughs> Thank you, Jason. <laughs> oh, yes, and Enra, you need to prohibit tuning. I've just noticed the tuning was on. Really? Yeah. I just I, I scrolled down to look at my brake balance, and I seen I seen the ride height was blue. I was like, oh, blue? It should not be. Oh, no limit. Prohibited. D. It should. Ah, oh, Mr. Monster. Hello. Hello. <laughs> um, Missy was there. Actually, give it Aston a quick whip. See if it actually feels any different. Yo, Cordell, Cordell, what's happening, bruv? Your first assignment, that's ah, fudging absolutely amazing because it's still seven o'clock. Fudging nice. amazing, mate. That's, <laughs> that's brilliant, man. One down, five more to go yet. But still, that's one down. That's, that's awesome, man. Hopefully, that gives it. Gives you a bit of a confidence boost, seeing as you smash that one. Nothing to worry about, man. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. <laughs> so, did you guys hear about that new medication for the red lesbians? <laughs> no. It's called Tripox again. Tripox. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. 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 Jablo. Mm -hmm. Too much mass bodies. It's too hyped up. <laughs> Yo, Paul, welcome back. We're gonna jump to the gym and do some studying and off the bed. No problem, man. Lift some weight for me as well. Yeah, I need to get back in the fitness, start running and stuff. Ready for ready for judo coming back because if I uh, thingy what?
What do you got, like sciatic problems or? Uh, I had like some really bad issues uh, from mid July up until uh, mid August. Hey guys, how are you? Yo, hey. Hello, be lazy. Hey, I'm gonna use the mic screen. Let's go. Just getting my. getting back behind the wheel, and then I'm ready to go. Go for it. Oh yeah. No, 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 no. I had a monster mm -hmm. yesterday for the, that green one that I took, took a picture of. And I have to say, it's kind of nice. I think it was green apple. Yeah, the race is starting. Well, I'm getting your ice cream there, bud. But, can't beat coconut and blueberry and Red Bull. Uh oh. I don't see. <laughs> I don't see any of them. No energy drinks, so uh, no... Another way, get out of the way! Move, child! <laughs> God damn, that was quick. How did this question, guys? Lego? How do you... Lego, dude. Oh god, I'm racing with a shoe on. This does not feel right. <laughs> Bit my knee just sliding into turn three. Mm -hmm. You leave my cones alone. Uh, hey, I don't take cones. <laughs> oh, <great. laughs> I need them too. <laughs> They're my friends. Oh, I stop. I started. What do you want, monster? I give you ice cream. Like, okay. Uh, looking for spots on the tracks where the cones are. Yeah. No, you can take it in your so room as long as you don't make a mess. I don't know where any of the cones are. I get wrong all the time. <laughs> I'm okay, learning great. the camera, I'm so... Get the shoe off. Someone had skill to knock out that cone on the first corner. I need to pay attention, but I never had to hurt now when you come in. <laughs> Try not to tap ya. Thank you for Breeze Air Freshener for like hitting me in the face. I've got it on a toe man, it did just went out of my face and my long left hand up. Well, the, uh, the bowler I just spat in the face. <laughs> <laughs> it did, did, did feel like that because I'm always <laughs> wondering what it was. It was off at random times during the day. Yeah. Shallow into turn one there.
it out for the apply to the time penalty. Sorry, Epi. So good man, I was on the other side of the track. any of the car. Yeah. Yeah, that's the one I'm in as well. I've only got back to using it because I used to, when I got to A+, plus, it had the camera I was using. I use both. I use the radar and the mirror at the top. Your fastest lap as well. By <laughs> 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 zero point zero one five. I don't like this. <laughs> oh, I like winning. <laughs> Who doesn't? For one more, no problem, my man. Good timing for me as well. Uh, ten past seven, and I need food. Anybody know what the menu race is on Saturday? I am Sukuba, uh, Group 3. Yeah. We couldn't keep up. 
No. Whatsoever. Kinda felt bad for him though. Yeah. <laughs> Does anyone talk to you? You low key sound like Carlos Sainz. Me? Yeah, you. He does, yeah. <laughs> That's a first I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing. <laughs> and I don't know why I've got Carlos Sainz's voice in my head. Is it the um, far left? Yeah, it's, it's hidden. Yeah, the you hidden. Gotta go the up the hill and then it's like yeah. right there. What time are we looking at? 122.4. Trying to get back to the A plus area. So I'm learning back on the, on the camera that I got the A plus on. Obviously, you feel comfortable. Okay. Obviously, you feel comfortable on that view. I just bought my camera. Yeah. I think I've always used it in Grand Turismo. As I'm driving, could be. Top of the Valium, put chase car. I can get that into a 21 with a fly. Actually, I just did.
Sky Emerald, you're clearly on a fire there. Jeff wants to see me sad. I'm gonna squeeze in the middle of you. Mm. <laughs> it's good old snoogly and warm. I'm 
down the bubble tip, we'll just see what he's doing. <laughs> we'll just buy his parents' time. <laughs> <laughs> the same as me, I think. And you will break a lot later into there than me, right? As long as you break before the quest, it's easy, alright? Somewhere on the big, the big thick rubber marks on the quest. Have we got a drift challenge on for head pay? GRT's number one news reporter. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Got that map. Oh yeah, he's got it. Um, yeah, I was on about Matt's welcome message. Yeah. Why is Matt not on? Oh. Yeah, he usually a couple of races. Nah, I'm going to spam the invite. What are you doing there? I mean, this one and another one. This one. <laughs> yeah, I need to work out my braking for what I have. But of course not. Because I'm like, I can tell it's the bigger place I lose to you, um, Enra. So I go pull, I get, got the best sector one on anyone. Looking at the time. And it's sector two that gets me. 
Pepe, I'm not on here, but I'm on here. side because there is some coming up. Definitely. Oh, you've got reset to the middle of the track. Stop part. Yeah. Is Maybe it the free yeah. market? Yeah. You're big there, you're too late. Oh, there. Right, so if I go... Okay. I'm going to go back and find them, because I want to get this. You see in front of my car? I yeah, I've got the point dot. I've the start of the curb in, on the right hand side. Boop. Of course it's in the corner. The corner's much better the other way. <laughs> I love to roll down. <laughs> I don't know where to start from. <laughs> start here. Yeah, I'm, I'm slowly getting it down. <laughs> Just before the three board. Yeah, on the curb and on the right. On the right. Yeah. Is what it looked like. Just before the. Just before the crest. Still too late. Too early. I'm happy to start. Yeah. Get some food in our bellies. Yep. I've already had food. I've got thug kids. Calling his name. Screaming, <laughs> Screaming from the kitchen. And, uh, oh, I'm in last place anyway. We need you to eat us. Because Henry is the one I want to battle. Like, get up to his face. <laughs> battle. Right, that's a great thing. You all to block me, you're free wide. Free wide! Oh, Just standing there, menacingly. <laughs> Me, I am not attacking you with this one. I said you didn't get caught somewhere. Oh, break, 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 break. Sausage perfect. Did you? <laughs> Did, but it right between my legs. Oh, I 
kill us on. Yep, there's a sound.
Ah. <laughs> Milk sucks. Yeah, my, a good room that's right. Yeah, I was. I was a doink. I was only shooting. <laughs> to be fair, I was thinking I was screwed when that. When I lost my chance in against M3 Nick on that. The corner after the corkscrew. Yeah. And then I saw that you fell a lot behind. <laughs> so I was like, mm, okay. Thank you, Damien, and welcome. Yeah. I don't know how I got that. Unfortunately, that was the last race. I'm just going to <laughs> call it a night for this uh, slot. I think there may be a, a lobby in about an hour, but I'm not 100% sure. Enra. Yeah. You've never seen me short shift so hard on um, M3 go on the last corner. <laughs> I literally, I don't even think I... I think M3 guy... I don't know if he backed out, because he had the inside line going up towards the corkscrew. I was thinking, well, this could be interesting. And then I saw on the radar that they felt just all of... When I hit my breakpoint, a bit late. But I was on outside, so I was gonna have a good line that going down here. I just saw him drop back down, and I was okay. We're on a flyer now. <laughs> cool. I gotta admit, that was a good race. I honestly, for every single battle I did into the corkscrew, I didn't even see my breaking point because <laughs> I was on the inside and couldn't actually see it. So close. I think I think it was lap one. Mm -hmm. I took that corner before going up towards the court suit so perfectly that I just walked past Matt <laughs> up the hill. I I had a so bad go for the court screw and then I just saw Matt. It's like, mm. <laughs> at least it wasn't that bad. Yeah, that's why I hate the court screw. I love the track, but. The corkscrew, I just haven't really gotten to grips with. No. I don't think anyone has. <laughs> like, you know the whole first week this game came out, the um, Laguna Sega came out? Yeah. I think I was like 150th in EMEA. Because see performing around there is quite fun. Oh yeah. Lots and lots of fun. Ingrid's type in his life story. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's just put it in But um, that's not in the chat. Good racing in three guy. I was expecting carnage up at the course here, but he did good. It's so hard though going into that corner before going the uphill towards the course two when you're behind someone and you're right on their ass. Because you can't oh, yeah. see your break point. It just yeah, that's there. what I did. I went I got such a launch off the corner before. Yeah. I, it was either, it was either, it was either Nick or um, Jason. And I got such a launch. I went, to, I had the inside line for it. But I broke so early. He could literally just turn in on his normal racing line. Uh, I don't know. I don't think it was me. I fell behind uh, after the second lap. There, took that corner mm. wrong and went right out into the dirt. Yeah, Ooh, he's uh, on a livery mission. I'm it. not. <laughs> I'm gonna have to play catch up. Alright. Just putting something well, not on to, to see out the see out the stream. Because uh, yeah, this we're gonna. Made for a uh, hard span. Yeah. Very nice. So, yes, that's it. Uh, Does anybody <laughs> got any red GRT tags? Red? There is some out there, okay. I 
think there's an Ural GRT Sports. Yeah. Esports is red. They're most um, of them are color changing. Are they? Oh, okay. It'll be on TJ's account. The old GLT esports. And I know that Sean or GRT Emperor is uh, working on uh, uh, the GRT text, like the G and the RT. Yeah. Your flag on it. Yeah, I've seen it. He's, yeah, it's not it's cool, man. Some. I have I've already put one on one of my cars. <laughs> Ooh, sweet. Yeah, I stuck one on the uh, on the SLO last night. <laughs> Slapped it on there. Oh, host has ended the game. Well, that looks like it's the end of the stream, everybody. And, uh, thank you, everybody, for joining. Nice, quiet lobby. <laughs> Did you? Yeah, it was. Uh, <laughs> we didn't get it up and running. But uh, actually. I had a bit of had, had fun. And these few yeah. races. Cordell needs to get his shit sorted so he can start <laughs> racing. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I like racer, he wanted to jump in. Yeah, oh definitely he would have uh, joined. You know, some weeks we have full but lobbies, some weeks it's quiet ones. Yeah. And this was I'm a guessing quiet like week. thirty minutes to an hour maybe. <coughs> has one yeah. up. God God sure don't wanna have one up soon. I think so anyway. But you should do. But if not, there'll be a late slot. Yeah. But for Man, us, I get a lot of m emails from Jim Shark. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Jim Shark. Well, Come on. Well, I guess spending. Let's see. I would say I spent close to eight hundred pounds. Oof. I'm close. From there, so. Up, up Except this friend request from Jazzy. Good, good, very good. <coughs> nope. oh, I almost nice. deleted the request. No, oh, not oh. that one. <laughs> Except it. <laughs> right. Well, I'm going to close down the stream, everybody. Thank everybody for watching. Thank you, yeah, everybody, for joining. Uh, don't forget to like, likes. subscribe, Ooh. leaving comments, and yeah. We will see, see everybody next time. Mm -hmm. Can I see you later.